Okay guys, um, I'm outside. I drove about a block away to go through this sort of stuff. Um, you can see the Super Scope and Duplos back here, but uh, GameCube haul, back and forth. Didn't really have a price on it. Got it all for 75. Now this is pretty sweet because it's got three controllers. They all look, and they're all original Nintendo ones, a black one. I don't think there was an AV cable in there. It's got the microphone for one of the games and random, okay, so Chazzy Empire and <laughs> I, I was like, you got to see some of these games that were there, like just uh, Super Monkey Ball 2. Why is there two Super Monkey Ball 2s? Uh, Mario Party 6. Man, the museum I have. Sorry, Mario. Oh, okay. Mario Party 4. Yes. What do we What do we got here? Super. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Don't have it in my collection. Now, Mario Kart, guys, I wanted to show you guys this. If you notice, I think that one's worth more. So it's a game I do have in my collection, but it's a different box. Um, I've also wanted to throw out here a nice Twilight Princess. So just, uh, is it in? Yeah, I got to make sure everything's still in there. I didn't see any memory cards or anything yet, but uh, $75, amazing haul. I do have Resident Evil 4. So I'm going to, like I said, flash it all up on the screen, but three Mario parties and... Super Smash, Mario Kart, Zelda Twilight, like, this is a win, man. Okay, looters, here's the haul for parts one and two. Here's everything I spent, everything I sold, the other video game stuff that I spent, and my weeks, or non-video game stuff, really, and my weeks total. Here's roughly the number of items that I've added to my collection. And finally, here are my season totals. I wanted to apologize to everyone. Um, just had the birth of our second kid, and I have been super busy lately, so the videos are they're slowly coming. I have a couple in the back burner that I just haven't posted yet. And, you know, I also went back to work. I'm a teacher, so, you know, beginning the school year is always kind of rough. But a couple items I wanted to pull, like just talk about uh, when it comes to the NES haul, uh, Mega Man 5, I never thought I'd see something like that in the wild. It is the most pricey and probably the most, I don't, I, I'm assuming it's the most rare of the Mega Man games for the NES. And uh, to have that in my collection right now, it's retailing for like 75 bucks, just a loose card if you were to go to a show or something. And so I was glad to add that to my collection. And uh, I know Kirby's only a $15 game, but it's a game from my childhood that I didn't own. I used to rent it or borrow it from a family friend. And so I was, you know, pretty glad to get that in the collection as well. Um, when it comes to the GameCube stuff, oh, before I do that, the NES, unfortunately the NES does not work. It's got a bad power supply, but I'm parting it together with another NES. So hopefully I can get that thing fired up. Um, as for the GameCube haul, a um, couple things. I sold Mario Party 4 back in the day. I got a really good deal, like, really good price for it and parted with it. And I normally don't like to sell, like, non-doubles. So I was always kind of wanting to get that back in the collection. So I was really excited about that. Uh, Soul Calibur uh, 2. I have actually been playing a decent amount lately. Uh, I, I knew that, that one's the cool version because the Xbox version had Yoda and the PlayStation version had um, Darth Vader, I believe. So it was just kind of a unique sort of item. Uh, Melee, uh, I owned a long time ago, didn't own it, didn't want to play the price, you know, pay the price for it. And uh, that Mario Kart Double Dash is worth a few more dollars, and I'm, I'm going to keep both in my collection. Everything else works, runs great. Uh, you know, another new N64 game, check it off the list. You know, I'm, I'm eventually going for a full any, you know, N64 collection, so it's not that hard to do. And honestly, my favorite piece of all is this box, Super Scope 6. It's worth probably about 80 bucks. Everything is in there. Um, I haven't tested to see if it works, but everything looks like brand new. There's no fading, no chipping. All the manuals, the advertisings, the inserts, everything is there, which is just really, really rad. So um, that GameCube haul, man, was worth a crap ton of money. So I, I was able to negotiate that back and forth. So that was pretty cool. So... Anyways, I hope you guys like what you see. You know, I'm going to start doing some other videos. Uh, like I said, I do this kind of just fun on the side. I'm really more into the collecting. And, you know, it's it's just the, the small few followers that I have with this channel make me kind of keep it going. So I hope you guys liked what you see. Remember, one man's trash is another man's loot. Guys, have a great rest of your day.